Alright, welcome back to a new game and a new chapter. In this part of the course, we'll implement a complex game that I'll simply name Shoot the Monster. So the game goes like this. We have an enemy in the center of the stage, it will never move, and I'm commanding that little spaceship with the left and right arrow keys. And as you can notice, the ship rotates around the monster and can shoot bullets towards it. But the monster is protected by those layers of protection. And the only way to harm the monster and defeat it is to shoot our bullets through that little hole. If we defeat the monster in one level, the monster will protect itself and will add another layer of protection and will start shooting bullets and time bobs at an ever faster rate. Now I've played this game many many times and I'm pretty good at it, but the game becomes quite challenging towards the end. There are five levels in total and I'm here at the last level. Now because the game is quite challenging, it's very rewarding once you actually beat the game, so you see this nice explosion of the monster and you're left on the stage to enjoy your victory. So go to your stuff and create a new project. And go to this lecture in the course dashboard and download the starter project for shooting the monster. So click on this and download it to your computer and unzip this file. Then after you've downloaded and unzipped the file, in your Scratch project, go to File and Load from your computer and select the Shoot the Monster SB3. And we should have our project imported with all the sprites that we need to program this game. So let's start doing that in the next video.